Hi guys, um, today we are learning about dots. What dots means? Difference of two squares. Difference of two squares. For example, if you have uh, two numbers, for example, 5 square take away 4 square. To work out the solution to this, probably we can do it in our head, 25 take away 16. But there is another shortcut method. If I add these two numbers up once, 5 plus 4, and take them away at the same time, 5 take away 4, and multiply the answers together. 5 plus 4 is 9 times by 1, so my answer is 1, is 9. So we can use this technique in algebra. Another example involving algebra, if I have uh, x squared take away 9 squared. So we can use the same technique once we add them, x plus 9 and x minus 9. So we don't have to multiply any further. That's your that's for as far as we can go. I can create many other questions, for example, x squared minus 2 squared. My answer will be x plus 2 and x minus 2. Sometimes examiners write the question, for example, like x squared minus 49. Now, you should be able to see that 49 is a square number, 7 squared. Then you can do your next step, which is x plus 7 and x minus 7. I can stretch this topic by introducing another number in front of x squared. For example, 4x squared minus 49. Now, you should understand that 4x squared is 2x whole squared minus 7 squared. And then my answer becomes 2x plus 7 and 2x minus 7. You have to make sure you always have two squares. Another example 25a square y square take away 121. Now you should understand that this question can be written as 5a y whole square minus 11 square and now my answer now will be 5a y plus 11 and 5a y take away 11 this is dots difference of two squares now you can try these questions first one b square minus 6 square second x square minus 64 third a square b square take away c square fourth hundred a square take away b square and 225 x squared take away 49 y squared. 